one free add-on, 50 tools, why was I not using this earlier? So we're looking at a free add-on that's within Blender. You just need to enable it, edit, preferences, and bagger pie. For some reason I was calling it bagger pipe. Bagger pie. So it's actually in the get extensions area where there actually is a whole bunch of free add-ons. Uh, so yeah, go through that, but you know, subscribe to the channel and I'll eventually go through all these as well. But we're gonna do a quick overview of some of the tools. So if I press the J key with the plane, but the plane, all right, with the plane selected, we can, for instance, let's go add in a linear stair at the 3D cursor, sure. J, and we've got spiral stairs, pretty cool. If we just make it a little bit bigger, just give it a little bit more contrast. There we go. J, handrail, and we can draw in handrails. We can go J and pipes, and then we can draw in pipes as well. That's cool. Oh, there's even like the, the, the spinny thing. And these are all editable because these are all geometry nodes as part of the pack. So if I press um, N to bring on the side panel, I've already got bagpipe there and we've got the fence selected. We can obviously change kind of like the size, the, I don't know, the offset of the panels. So this is the glass. We can change the height. There we go. Size of that. Nice. Um, we can even change from going uh, from round poles to square poles. That's cool. But also as well that they've set it up so each material has a slot. So as we kind of go through and start adding in some of these weird uh, materials, they update. One of these materials is a leaf. I don't know which one it is. And it's the exact same thing with the pipe. Obviously we can kind of like increase the radius, radius decrease the radius. Um, we've got junctions, how many of those junctions we can add in how long we want those junctions to be, so on and so forth. So that's, that's cool. Now, the other cool thing that we showed originally at the start as well is I'm gonna shift right click where the 3D cursor is. I'm gonna select our staircase. Let's go J, Ivy, and it's added in Ivy. Amazing balls. What else we can do is if I, for instance, I'm just gonna scale this down just so we don't kill things. Ah, uh, well, I won't. Let's just add in another plane for now. Right click subdivide, subdivide, subdivide. Subdivide. If I select our two IV pieces and then we go on select our plane, I can go GA and we can do scatter paint and I can draw on where we want all this IV to be. And obviously up here, it's just kind of like the paint tool. All right. From here as well, come up to the top, max density. We can go up to like 100. 150, minimum distance, 0.02. Really thicken that puppy up. Then when we come to object mode, I'm just gonna move that plane down a smidgen so it's under the ground. But how schmick is that? Still here, like and subscribe. Comment down below what other add-ons should be looking into. If I have to buy one, I'll buy one.